All right, no big deal. I've just got to find out which one of them's lying to me. Time for things to get a bit interesting, and also probably good time for a new manual save. They're quite spread out, and that also means I have to retrace my steps. Ah, if only they could be in non-infected areas. I might stop after this one. Eh, that one's pretty easy to get to. But before going to that one, I might loop down and try to deal with this situation. Might even do that now, like talk to this guy, go down to see what I can do about this, then come back up, because that's way out of my way. But it also sounded timely. But these guys are going to be gone this evening. Everything kind of sounds timely. Like something I should take care of right now. Can I read the reports? I don't even have them on me anymore. Great. They don't seem to trust me. I'll have to resort to deception. I will have just one question to ask each of them. A question which they may tell the truth or tell a lie. There's no room for error here, however. So I must first solve the puzzle myself. If only I could pass for one of them. It'd be easy to unveil the traitor. They know each other. They know very well which one of them it is. If only I could pass for one of them. Huh. Interesting. I'm gonna move on for now and deal with the other situation. Because I, I think I'm supposed to get a disguise that lets me pass as one of them. Because uh, we already had indication of that from the other guy's quest. And it seems like we need that to do that for this quest, too. Meds. Meds. Oh, they got that guy. He's dead. <laughs> How do I pass as one of them? I don't know. I checked the theater. God damn it. What is your attack range? How am I missing? God damn it. All right. Uh, my poor immunity. The poor bachelor goes through a lot. <laughs> I don't know how that guy's attacking me. How does a rat have more range than a guy with a knife? I'm stabbing like crazy. None of it's hitting, but the rat can claw at me at that range. Gotta go this way. Little spooked. I've never gone this way. I suppose all this time in non-infected dis districts gives my my poor lens some time to recharge. How a lens recharges as conceptually? Not sure. That's weird. Nothing. Okay. Tell me a story. Are you for real? All right then. Here's the tale of the Gorkon River and its tributaries, the Gullet and the Guzzle. Long time ago, there lived an old man by the name of Bai Uraga. He had the head of a bull, the body of a man, and a cow's hooves for hands. What about his legs? His legs stretched all across the earth, sinking, sinking into it like gigantic roots. He ate rocks, grass, and the trees that were to be found in his vicinity at first. But it didn't take him long to eat everything that his head could reach. And so, the ground around him turned to desert. Then what happened? All in all, he was gluttonous and helpless. After eating everything he could reach, old Bayer or Uraga felt thirsty. Guess what happened next? I can't possibly imagine. Think some more, then. I'll tell you the ending if you tell me what happened after he felt thirsty. What? Really? Poor old man. I don't have to tell you this, you know. Sorry for interrupting. He must have died. Correct. What does that have to do with the river? That's part two of the tale. I'll tell you later. Looking forward to it. So that you can't get part two anyway. You have to come back tomorrow. Good disease. All right. Right. This is the Olgimski. I should talk to him because I'm here. Basically, it's the entire reason. 
I'm getting very diseasy, aren't I? Not easy being diseasy. Aglaia was the one who was taught harass. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I already have the map, which means I was already here today, you dummy. Just prepping my gun. If he went on, on, on his own to fight some kidnappers, that's multiple enemies if it comes to combat. I'm not I'm not gonna try to deal with a knife in that situation, I think. How am I doing on bullets, by the way? Oh, only ten. For the longest time I haven't been I stopped training for bullets so much because combat that required them was actually getting pretty rare. But now we have these guys that have ranged attacks, and trying to knife them is just not a good idea. You can't just feather their attack range the way you do with the the other looters. Because they'll just hit you in the face with fire. It takes out half your health instantly. It's a bad call. How do I navigate this kind of area? So far he's not been really up for crossing water. Can I walk across here? Yes. Hey, it's those guys. Oh, there's a bridge over there. Well, now I feel silly, and also maybe going in the water has damaged my immunity or something. Great. I'm sure they're nice. These kinds of guys are down this. Oh yeah, it's the same guy that attacked me at the beginning. Fuck. Could you not? Uh. I would advise against this kind of behavior, frankly. If you could just not. It does not end well for you. Oh. Well, that's hard to aim. Oh boy. That's not good for my ammo count. Which I have zero of, I think? Uh... Knife time. Hi. God damn. This sucks down here. Hey, Twirin Extract. God damn, they don't even... Did they, did they know who I was already or something? Because they, they attacked on sight. Like, instantly. I am... I don't have space for this stuff. Uh, health is not great. Let's use the... One of these guys. Uh, I bet this stuff might be valuable, too. I can't carry all of it. Variable quality. 64%, 55%, I mean, I could use one of them, I guess. Not great for your health. Helps with the immunity, though. That one's really good. That one's probably the weakest one, and that's probably the strongest one. 45% immunity boost while giving only negative 7 health is a good ratio. Well, here they are. Why do you all come here to gawk at me? Uh, I was saving your life, asshole? Ah, you've come at last. Thanks. But evidently it has all been pointless. I'm an idiot. Where's Eva? Is she alive? No. I'm pretty certain she is dead by now. There was a mistake, it seems. A terrible mistake. Although there was a reason for us to come here, too. Oh, to hell with this. A, a mistake? Tell me. 
I, just, I received a farewell letter from Ava informing me that she was planning to take her own life at the, at the cathedral, convinced that a miracle would be there for her. She wanted to jump from the balustrade and fly. An insane, rambling letter, apparently written by an already deranged person. And then what? I barely had time to comprehend what had happened. Then the dancer, Ayan, appeared. She said that the worms were sending their regards. They were thankful that I had fed my woman to them. We're even now, they said. You know me. Without further dilly-dallying, I put two and two together and came to the conclusion that they were referring to Ava. Why in the world did, didn't you ask her who they were referring to? Well, I just assumed it, ha it could have been Ava, and went straight to the worms, and I sent the girl to you in case Ava had indeed decided to end her life at the cathedral. But Ayan messed everything up, so here we are. Here we are where? What do you mean? Ava jumped from the balustrade of the cathedral. That's, that's the kind of a cathedral we have now. Consecrated by suicide. The poor Ava thought otherwise. She wanted to become the soul of the cathedral. She knew that the stupid construction was not intended to be a focus. What focus? You mean the focus the Canes mentioned? Erecting a construction that can hold a soul is not humanly possible. We've only managed to do it once. Just recently, but that's another story. You'll c come to know everything in due time. As for our cathedral, it's cursed. The whole town is since today. She wrote a letter to me, too. She said she was going to purify the place for the new guest. That means the place in the cathedral and the guest is Aglaia, right? It makes sense. She wrote to me that the only thing she was always ready to give her life for is the cause my brother and I helped have pledged ourselves to. So she wanted to imbue the building with her soul. That was her personal interpretation of our cause. An interpretation both deranged and lovely. She knew how to get straight to the heart. But her interpretation was too literal. Someone must have put it into her head. And I think I know who. Somehow this death has impacted me more than the thousands upon thousands of other deaths that have occurred here recently. Yes, it does feel that way. Let's go, Andre. There's nothing left in the, uh, for us in this march. I've had my share of. Huh. No dialogue. She's just kind of here. So this, this is the outskirts, this is the, the randos, not the randos, but this is the, the creature-like people we've been hinted at over and over again. There's these guys and there's the ones that are strangely covered in stuff. Huh. I mean, I, I can't carry all of it and there's not much to do about that. Just gotta head back out. My exhaustion's so high because of the drugs, because of the infection, because of all the blah. Several negative things stacking at once. Ava is no more. All she wanted was to put a miracle into practice and become the living soul of the lifeless cathedral. Could it be that she chose the most terrible act imaginable to accomplish this? Ava. Ava, there is an enormous gap between self-sacrifice and suicide. This is, a, this is over now. Ah. Uh. I have two quests. One is to get a costume, one is to figure out who is lying. Not the most promising situation. I'm a little concerned. Because the quest dialogue seems to suggest that I should try to pass as one of them, but how? I haven't been given any established way to get a bird costume. They suggested the theater. But nothing happened there. I guess one thing I can do is just make a save and hope things work out. <laughs> Talk to them and see if I can 
get the answer out of them even without the costume. In this case, I wish I had not gone... I wish I had talked to him while I was there, because now I need to go the, now I need to go all the way back again. But uh, uh this is four o'clock already. This day's melting melting away faster than it feels like it is. It's the long walks that do it. I can spend hours talking to people and the time doesn't pass if I'm just constantly talking to people and keeping busy. But the long walks are really where the planning comes into this game. They affect your schedule of how you pass through the game while simultaneously being a thing like where time is passing in real time the entire time you're walking in a way that it doesn't when you're shopping or uh, questing, talking to people in other contexts. I don't know if I want that stuff now. I do want that. I do want that though. I do need to go back back to buying ammo. I'm not sure if I want to overinvest in their drugs right now, though, when I know I can get Schmatter for 10, which is not that expensive compared to the other, the other pills, actually. The problem is that it's so rare. The little girls are rare, too, the ones that have it. It's, it's, always, been the, it's always been a little girl. Like, they're really little girls. And uh, I've, I think I've never been able to afford it. <laughs> it always surprises me. give me answers. I know that one of you always tells the truth, another always lies, and a third does a little bit of both. I hope you're not going to deny that. It is true, but how does that help you? Which of those are you? I am the honest servant, of course. Were you expecting a different answer? Alright, let's get notes. I'll call you watcher. I'll, call, I'll number the watchers left to right. I'm naming. I said that the answer to the first question was that it's true. And he claims to be honest. Undoubtedly. Any other conversations? Which of the three was the Knots Watcher? Knots and Earth. He says that Knots is a liar. I'll go talk to him. Which of the three is the Earth Watcher? That's the one that does a little bit of both. His words are part truth, part lies. So this guy... The Earth and Knots. I'm so bad at the names of the regions in this game, unfortunately. But I know that the other two are Earth and Knots. When I talk to a second one of them, the option will be something else. And then either Earth or Knots. And that'll help me, and then at that point I'll be- I'll have the list down. That guy's just fucking standing there! What is this AI? Yay! Asshole. I want to look for evidence of what happened to Ava. They, she supposedly jumped from the roof of this building. Oh, that guy's screwed. He has two different criminals there, and I can't... I can't get over there. Is her body around here? Or did they already take care of that? I'm looking for any evidence that she did, in fact, kill herself, or... Like, a blood stain, or even, like, there might even be an item... ...that indicates her behavior, or something. I don't know. 
I guess that's that. I don't think we're gonna get follow up on that, no. Is that guy still fighting these guys? I assume he... I mean, he's gotta be dead. There was a... There was a mugger and uh, a pyro, a pyro asshole dude, arsonist. I don't see any conflict here though. Like it all just disappeared. It might have just disappeared, honestly. Have you seen any of the bird mask people nearby? Executors. They took to hiding behind masks, fancy that. Never mind that they seem to appear at every corner. So Birdface sneaks up at you, and then what? How do you know who's hiding? Oh, we've done this before. You'd be better off helping them rather than putting yourself at risk uselessly. I had, I had that conversation earlier today. Lots of guards around here, huh? It's almost like the canes live right there. Notice that discrepancy? So what we have here looks like it's going to be a logic problem. Like pretty standard type where you draw the grid and put all the X's down to figure out w which person means what. Give me bullet. A relatively straightforward logic problem where you compare the answers with each other and find the contradiction and then determine who must be lying based on said contradiction. The question is, will two people be enough or will I need to talk to all three? It's a long walk. I need to find a worker so I- oh. God damn it. There's waste that bullet nugget. God damn it, I didn't even get credit. Uh Bummer. Ah. Uh. What am I doing? There's nothing to reload here anyway. Oh shit. He's, he's, he's destroying these guys. There you go, buddy. You get to live. Damn, I thought you guys would have him, like, no problem. I went off on a little journey, and then came back to find out they were super dead. Alright, I need to heal before I die. Now, hunger's up, and also exhaustion, so rations, coffee... I have a lot of coffee right now. Hunger. All meters are in the green. And also there's a murderer here again. Oh, two guys that can sell me band- Oh, no! No! Stop! Is it gone? Ah, rat. God damn it, game. Leave me alone for five seconds. So much to juggle. I'm like, I want to trade both these people before that guy murders them, but I also hear somebody throwing firebombs around. Oh, here comes the murderer. And then just to add to the pile, surprise angel cloud just- Oh, no! Stop that. I, lo I need that guy's help. There we go. You took a shit! No! Bandages! Bandages! My poor health bar, god damn. Not making negative progress on bandages, so we're just having a bad day now. Kid! There's no dialogue for these guys anymore, apparently. You just like blades and stuff, so you're safer to trade with. Why can't I- why can't I trade for these tablets? 
No, I uh, no, I was a that was a misclick. I have to go back. That's so fucked. <laughs> That's such a bad mistake to make. Just lose all of my trading items. Ah, I let a lot of damage happen to me and a lot of mistakes go. But that one, that one's pretty bad to let to the, just let accept. Where am I now? Oh, jeez, the wall. Oh god, the disease. Uh, no. Oh god, that's where I quick saved. Terrifying. Okay, well I got away. Jesus. Hey, buddy. Don't get him, don't get him. That's terrifying that I quick saved right when the bad thing was happening. Alright. Yeah, you still suck. Okay, so he didn't have anything on him. Is he going after me or that guy? He's going after him. Hey, buddy. And now my infection's up? Mm. Did you just get credit for- You fucks! Mmm! What is this bullshit magic where if somebody else punches the guy, all of his items disappear? Because that's infuriating. That's just an annoying mechanic. Alright, the game is, is now determined that I have reached a level of sufficient infection where I am in deep shit, as it turns out. Oh, great. Could probably deal with that, which will also hurt me in turn. I don't think these have respawned yet. Yeah, seems like a no. He says true to the first part. Which one of those are you? I am honest, of course. Yeah, of course you'd say that. Stone yard, okay. So one is stone yard. Two is the knots and three is earth all right so he says true that he's honest i am honest i think they're all going to say true to the first question the one about uh the premise which of the three is the stone watcher yard watcher he does both Okay. I'll go talk to him. Which one's the Earth Watcher? He's the liar. Okay, so Stone says that he's honest. Knott says that he's honest. Knott's calls Stone the liar. Sorry, uh, Stone calls Knots the liar and Earth both. Knots calls Stone both and Earth the liar. I think one of these guys already has to be the liar. I think one of them has to be the liar. I'm trying to think about this this condition where of somebody who is both, apparently. But I sometimes tell the truth and sometimes lie. That implies that somebody will tell the- will say one thing is true and the other one's not- uh. I don't know, there's definitely already a contradiction. Like, full-on contradiction. I don't think I'll be confident coming up with an answer until I talk to the last guy. I'm not psyched about it.